Hi, I'm Carson here with the SB2005 and the SB2009. Just want to give you a quick overview of uh, maintaining the pump. We're also going to go over a couple of common and uncommon issues that you might run into in terms of repair when you get the pump back into your shop. Okay, our first step is to remove the tank lids, which is held on by a half inch wing nut. As I look inside the tanks here, the B side looks pretty good, the A side not so good. As you can see, the crystallization of the A side, which is also the isocyanate side, when exposed to the air, it will develop a crust on there. You want to go ahead and use your hand and remove the big chunks. Using a small screwdriver or chisel, scrape as much as you can off of the tank. Don't worry about the little pieces because there will be a, a filter at the bottom of these tanks. Next, I'm going to open the drain valves and turn the pump on and purge out the rest of the material out of the pump. There we go, the tanks are empty. Now I can start working on this.